Hello guys, welcome back to latest program. So today we are going to learn a very interesting topic which is adding audio to our web page. So let's go to our coding. So uh, to add audio, we just need few things. The audio command or audio tag, open, closed. Second thing is audio. So you can see here. I have saved my song in the same folder where I have saved my folder contains. So here it is my song. So now what I really need? I need some basic things which is the command which will make my audio run. So to make the audio run we need a source. Here it is the source tag which is used to give the location of our video. So here we will use the src command and in, which in it we will give the location of our file. So the location of my file is song and its extension is .mp3. So I have just written it. Now you can uh, go to the properties of the song to find your source. So it's quite done. So let's just save it and run it and let's see how it works still running so you can see my song is not played so why what is the reason so the reason is we need further more commands to make it visible so what is next next is autoplay ok autoplay is used to play the song automatically when we load a page so I have used the autoplay and just allow save it and just let's refresh it from here only. Now you can see my music is playing. Yes, it's playing. So the let's pass a cut it, but I am I'm not getting how to stop my music. So to make it stop. Let's go for our further coding and let's see how it's going. Okay. So let's give the control command. So it's control, control. I have added the control and let's see is it working or not. So here you can see I've got the controls over. I can stop play and mute it and increase the volume so it's all about the control command now next is the loop so loop is nothing but it is used to just make the song runnable all the time so it is not going to stop unless you are going to stop it so I'm just giving demonstration of it also Here it is playing and I, I will go to the end. Okay, it will stop and play it again. So it is the use of loop. So it was all for today. So thank you for watching the video and if you have any questions or queries, just comment down.